right, another day here on Red Dirt Resale. Another unit we're about to load up. We got an empty truck and it's me and you guessed it, it's Ann. We're out here, we're in Ackworth, Georgia. I won this unit for $310. So not super cheap, but not really expensive. Just kind of, kind of in between. I mean, it's pretty cheap, $310. 10 by, I think it's a 10 by 25, not all the way full, lots of space in here, but there is a good amount of stuff. And all the pictures were blurry. I mean, I could see, you know, what was there. There's containers with stuff and a few pieces of furniture. There is, I think a mattress on that wall there that looked like it's probably trash from what I could see, but all the pictures were blurry, so I couldn't make out any detail at all. So let's see what we got. Now there is um, lots of toys, which it did say on their toys. This little tractor right here, this is cool. Little John Deere tractor. Okay, this is um, cooler than I thought. Like I said, it was blurry. I thought it was like um, something different. I thought it was plastic. That's metal. Little pedal tractor, that's really cool. So that's better than I thought because like I said, it was blurry. You could see from the back here, but couldn't tell much. Now it does stink in here. Smell that in? It stinks. Now right here we got, we have Pokemon or Yogi-Oh, let's see. Oh, these are um, Pokemon cards, whole bunch of Pokemon here. These are all, I mean, that's an energy, but that's not all, all energy. But it smells like, it smells like pee or rat pee in here. So that's not good. Oh, what you got there? Oh, man has got some baseball cards here. Pull that up and let's look at it. We might have more, oh, we got more cards. Okay, these are, it's like late 80s right here. Looks like some 90s stuff. 90s Bowman. So, as most of them, there's some upper deck 1990. Not a whole lot that's real good. That's This is like the time when they sold a ton of baseball cards. Late 80s, early 90s. That's what the most, of them, most of them that we find are in that time frame. What's this right here? I think this is some other cards maybe. Card, go, oh, they're falling out. There's Pokemon falling out down there it was upside down but look this is this is all pokemon this is 2021 so these are newer ones but yeah some of them are definitely falling out okay it's not full all those are empty but there so there's some pokemon oh, here at the beginning and they're all 2021 uh, 2023 so these are all newer pokemon if there are some newer ones that are worth money but obviously if you find those older ones that's where you can really get some money. Pokemon? Oh, yep, more Pokemon here. We're gonna pull it out. Let's see what this is. If this is, I don't think that's cards. I think this is like a, this is a Marvel, little Marvel notebook. So kid stuff can be sometimes not good because you'll get a lot of dirty stuff and broken stuff and everything, but you know, you can have some cool stuff, video games and collectible stuff. With good stuff here's all now this one has a lot okay there are some empty pages back there but there's a lot of pokemon that are actually in there and we've got more 2021 there's more. pokemon card game trainer's toolkit let's see all right we got a whole bunch of cards here i wonder if these are their special ones. 2020 but these are all lots of pokemon all different kinds too. Oh, we got little books here. This whole thing is all Pokemon. There's Pokemon um, books, I think, right there. Is that what that is? Well, maybe not. Mm. I don't know what that is. There's cards in this tin. Oh, that's a fun with Pokemon books. So, yeah, there is some cards in the this tin is there. card game. Trading Just card game the... rules. Yeah. There's Dreepy 2022. So. Pass them in. All right, I don't know a whole lot about it. I mean, I know what most people do, you know, the Charizard and yeah. some of those cards. <laughs> but look, whole bunch of Pokemon. The whole bottom is full of them. There's a ton of Pokemon cards. So even just with regular ones, I mean, you're, you know, it's still, it's still a few bucks. It's definitely yeah. something that you can sell, even if it's not big bucks. But that's all Pokemon. So a whole lot of Pokemon in that there. That's just the first box that we looked at here. I didn't even really start to look at anything until we found that. Kind of moving this way. Is this a Switch or let's see? There's a Nintendo Switch box. 
So whether it's going to be in there or not, and yes, I do see some rat dropping. So that is what that smell is. The rat pee smell. It's kind of, it's gross, but what is this right here? This is heavy. This little bag has got a lot of weight to it. I'm curious what's in here. All right. Well, hang on just a second. So once I do my initial look through here and I can get the camera on where I can use both hands and then we'll look in there. But we got games. There's Jumanji. Roblox Monopoly, Fortnite Monopoly. Coming back here, we got a um, washing machine. Looks like a pretty good washer. More toys, Nerf guns. Um, this is all like pieces of a bunk bed. And then back in here, lots of containers, lots of toys. I see more Nerf guns, I see minions. Stuff's falling out of the unit up there. Right here, I don't know about this area here, but a whole bunch of mattresses. Um, I see a garage, a Hot Wheels garage back there, and then all in this area here. Now, some of the stuff on the top is nasty because definitely there was a rat running around in here. And the top of this stuff, not good. Hopefully, when you get past that first layer, though, hopefully we're going to be all right. Closed. I mean, that looked clean. It's just the stuff on the very top there. There's an eye robot. We even find an eye robot. It seems like every unit we get one of these things here lately. Um, there is a little, um, not really a safe, even though it says century safe, but more like a firebox. We'll look at that here in just a minute. But lots of toys, books, toys, books, clothes. That's what a lot of it, is, a lot of it is that, that I can see from right here. Hoverboard. There's two hoverboards. I think there was no, yep, another hoverboard over there. But we will. Um, we're about to dig in and load it up, and we'll see what we find. Hopefully, we find that Nintendo Switch in here. Oh, on the dresser here, let's see, is there anything in here? A few pairs of socks and underwear, but a pair of jeans. So there's a few things in there. Not packed full or anything. All right, now i got the camera strapped on. I can use both of my hands, but a little backpack here. And Ann says there's baseballs in there. Oh, there they are. I was about to say, where are they at? But all done in the bag. A whole bunch of baseballs. And it sounds like seashells in the front there. Huh. Yeah. Yeah, that. I'm going to look over here while she's doing that. But oh, you, you called it right up. Oh, there you go. Seashells. <clears throat> but over here, I've got, we got some stuffed animals, but that one right there is dirty. We got Sonic here. He's, um, I don't know, it looks like maybe a dog got a hold of some of these. So stuffed animals on the top, not so good. Once we get down in here, what are we going to have? What is that? Okay, that's a shelf. Hard Rock Cafe glass. Just all kinds of stuff just thrown in there. Definitely have to look all the way down in here. Here's another little Pokemon book. There's no cards in that one, but if you look down in here, it's part of a phone. A lot of paper, paperwork in this one. We keep moving over here. We got more, more dirty animals. That's... That stinks. This is a cool one right here, King oh, Koopa, but he's a little bit dirty. And then we got Bucky here from oh, Bucky. Bucky's, and he's a little bit dirty. And see right there on his hand, looks like something chewed on him. Oh, it's probably the rat, I guess. Maybe the rat was nibbling because it's just like little, little nibble marks. Like right there, look, the rat chewed into in these spoons. Hmm. You think the rat's in here, Ann? Okay, Ann wants to call it a mouse. That makes her feel better, thinking it's a mouse instead of a rat. Got some rugs. I don't know what these wood pieces are down here. Let's see. Oh, it's like some kind of wall art. I want to see what this case is right here. Little black cases. Let's see. Little vault. And there's nothing in it. It is. And then down in there, we've got ties. I can't quite, those are kind of stuck down in, down in there to see what the um, wall art is, but several of these rugs. There's like three of those rugs right there. Little game. All right, moving along over here. These containers are not packed, they're just kind of stuff just thrown in and then spilling over the top. This has lots of games. I see cards against humanity. 
Oh, this is cool. We got a Coke. Is this Monopoly or? Oh, that's really cool. There, look. Coca Cola Opoly. Man, it stinks in here. And it's. It looks pretty good. I mean, the money and stuff's kind of coming. Coming out of place there, but look at all those pieces yeah. there. I don't even that know if it was really, yeah. really used. But Cocopoly, there's Fort, Fortnite Monopoly. I already pointed that out. We got Monopoly Jenga. I've never seen that before. I mean, it's probably at the store. I've just never noticed it. Uno Ultimate Marvel. All right, so some cool games. Moving along. Okay, let's look in this now that I got two hands. <clears throat> I think it's a nebulizer. Yeah, that's what it is. So, oh, look, it's a penguin nebulizer. Now I see what this is. This is an igloo. The bag looks like an igloo. That's kind of creative there. Games up. Here's another case. Probably, oh man, it's heavy. Probably poker chips. It's a poker set. And yes, it is. It's like they're all there. They're just kind of coming spilling out a little bit big blind small blind moving along this we got a little <clears throat> statue it's kind of cool terracotta statue and a st. Simon's Island ship it's like a little souvenir a four-leaf clover and then I think these are supposed to be like gold flakes it's like a souvenir thing I believe all right keep moving along here paperwork what is this what is this this oh this is really cool it's a little um tiki torch but look it looks like a little kind of a little bit looks like um Squidward's house but yeah it's like it's terracotta you put the oil in there and then you light it on that's really cool do we have anything down in here nope nope and nope and what's in here A little file thing here and just um paperwork A little paperwork okay keep moving down this side here Got an RC car, but missing the battery there. It's the Piper. Let's see what this. I think this is just all Nerf guns. Yeah, a whole bunch of Nerf guns here, and this one. So I don't know, five, six, seven Nerf guns. It looks like right there. Pile of clothes here on the floor. We're not gonna get back in there yet. What is this? This might be actual trash all right I'm gonna move up here I don't know what's that what that is in there a little bit of cleaning supplies or something there I'm gonna start rolling through this stuff here let's look at this a little bit closer I see the chain hanging down there so I don't know yeah it needs to be fixed the chain needs to be put back put back on to make it pedal right down there so I'll have to kind of see if I can flip it over and we get back and look at it see if I can get that chain back on all right and you want some water to drink here's some filtered water ready to go for the mouse. look they even got decon in here yeah. a little bit of weed be gone um, wash and wax. Go this way. So, clothes, I think there's gonna be some good clothes. You just gotta get stuff off the top layer. Here's a little statue. Mm -hmm. Down there in the clothes. Moving on this way, what is this? Oh, Samsung Gear VR virtual reality thing. I don't, doesn't really feel like it's in here. Um, well, actually, I think it is in there. But, I mean, but these things just don't really sell for a whole bunch of money. 
when they first came out they did but not anymore at least that's my experience all right we got lots of books here what kind of books do we have i think there's some um oh that's good right here we got some um minecraft box sets here looks in pretty good shape too it's all all the books are in there Let's see what other kind of books we have cat kid comic club cat kid so it looks like some good books some ones that are popular with kids right now i don't know if it's all kids books or not looks like a lot of them are though no 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 the great unknown i don't know what that is but so kids books and some not kids books oh man that one's heavy because of all the books all right now underneath that we got the century safe here and it's unlocked so what's in here we've got a message from the ceo and their life insurance we got a swiss army knife with a little gun on it a sharpie some other paperwork hold on my phone's ringing here all right so that's just paperwork so paperwork and a knife it's a nice little knife though and then what is in this gold golden box whatever right here okay i do see down on the floor there it's like see all those beans and everything that's definitely a mouse or rat or whatever has gotten into those and and throwing them all everywhere or, or either they spilled them out and then the rat was drawn in okay this is some kind of some kind of toy i don't know what this treasure is chest. toy treasure okay. chest but it has the key there but there's nothing in it so. and then this box here it looks like we got probably more uh, more books there's this goes to the irobot so let's set this over there with the irobot i got some kind of globe attached here hold on get this thing off so that goes with that and then we got the globe here i guess you plug it in and i don't know what it does talks to you or something yeah, but right here birthday cards we have lots of books look at that we got dr seuss books whole little stack of dr seuss there dog man I said some real good kids books there's a lint brush we got marvel stuff here or dc <coughs> lego books anything anything lego seems to do good and then we got some marvel puzzles over here and more pokemon <coughs> another little pokemon book there with a couple cards in it gym trainer but we got a 500 piece look at that that's pretty cool on the thor thor puzzle and then look right here we got the classic rubik's cube what is in that oh we got a magic eight ball look thanos don't know who that's supposed to be right offhand but with the magic eight ball down in there in between all the books lots and lots of books colored around the world christmas stories so kid stuff but then some of it's not kid stuff all right slide that over all right we had a dead right here at one time but he's not here no more i don't know if he decomposed or what but look there's the outline the tail there's some hair matted down I think it was underneath that though. I wonder if he got smashed or if he just mm -hmm. crawled in under there and died. died and got smashed. I don't know. <laughs> Sounds like a baby, doesn't it? <laughs> All right. Medieval times. Nunchucks. Oh, we got a Funko Pop down here. Stan Lee. That's kind of cool, a little golden Stan Lee. 
What's in this wooden box, Ann? Is it treasure? No. No. Nothing. nothing in there. No treasure. Another baseball. Some little wooden pieces. Here's another baseball. It's an Atlanta Braves baseball. Um, okay, late laser tag. Nothing's full right there. WD-40. This is a little dartboard or what is it? Nope, this is a, oh, it's a Atlanta United little banner. But that's all laser tag, laser tag. Down here we got another. That's the same one right there. It, and that was in there. That's a Funko. Here's another Funko. Spider-Man. He's got, a, got all the spider legs on him. What that is. Spider-Man web fluid. Here. Drink that and you'll be um, shooting spider spider webs out of your arms. Then we got a is this a bank or what is this? No, some kind of little Pokemon. Maybe it's a light. Turn it on. No, we can't use this because it's adult supervision required. Adult supervision? Hmm. I don't think we have any adults with this. And then we got um Black Adam here. Also, Dwayne the Rock Johnson. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so some goodies yeah, down in there. Yep, that's um, shoes. We'll throw all this in there. And then we got a ring box, but that's empty. It's for a little solar panel, but I can tell that's empty. Oh, we got a toolbox here. Are we going to find any tools in it? Uh, the classic Don't Break the Ice. I used to love that game when I was a kid. I still love it now, actually. I would play it right now. You want to play it, Ann? Yeah, let's go. All right, me and Ann, we're going to take a two-hour break here and play Don't Break the Ice. Uh, Man, look at that. It's, it was wet inside. It's still wet. Yeah. See all that rust and it's all wet. Man, I don't know how that happened. There are tools in there, but unfortunately a lot of them are going to be rusted. It's like soaking wet in here. Very odd. I mean, it had to just been wet in there when they put it in here. For whatever reason, and it's just been sitting there wet because nothing around this is wet. But right here with these beans and stuff Gosh. we got some watches let's see Charles Raymond fossil fossil that's like a smart watch right there I think and bands here some cufflinks I don't know what kind of watch that is there's no name here probably a name underneath but so that's decent. Wet tools. A whole bunch of sockets there. They got a little bit of rust on them, but, but mostly look pretty good. That's a rat trap right there. They must have came back in here and saw that they had rats in here and put some of this, the rat trap. Because there's one. You got the decon there. Maybe they didn't want to come back and get their stuff. They knew rats had been in here. But moving over here, that's for a computer, like a subwoofer. What do we got in here? Got some more tools, or at least a hammer. And what else? Jesus. All right, we got a little Willis Tower, Chicago statue. I don't know what that is. Here's a nice Dunkin' Butterfly yo-yo. Nice socket here, Stanley. And a power bank, maybe? Yep, oh, that's for the iRobot. Let me put that with the put it with the robot vacuum. Alright, I'm gonna keep kind of working over this way, which I think a lot of this is gonna be closed, but I think there is some other stuff. Kind of buried down in there and like i keep saying besides the top layer look right here we got a braves jersey it's a youth a little freddie freeman braves jersey that's a good item here's another jersey let's see this is a another freddie freeman we got two freddie freeman jerseys i don't know probably had multiple kids with all these toys and stuff here's another braves jersey freddie freeman so three little freddie freeman jerseys and down in here, look like these clothes, they're all folded up. So there's good clothes down in here. And then right.
right here where the iRobot is. Um, more clothes and look, these are all folded, 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 so those are all good. Well, I mean, at least not just wadded up dirty. That don't mean they're all good. They could still have holes or stains in them. Moving back. All right, right here on the top, we got some clothes, but I think there's other stuff underneath this, posters. What is this, other stuff under the posters? Looks like just some pictures and stuff, but a lot of posters, like that's Marvel. I see, um, looks like a Minecraft poster there. But this is a big Marvel poster. This one's, I've seen this before, that one's pretty cool. A little bit rough around the edges. Of the posters there. Mostly like some socks and underwear. Kind of. Alright, this bag here is like bathroom stuff. I don't know what if this is something expensive or not. Baoli Pharmacy. No idea. But if it is something expensive, that's good because it's a big old thing of cologne. But we got dove shampoo, dove soap. Big old thing of q-tips. A couple razors in there. I wanted to see if there's any more cologne, but I don't see any. Suction black mask. So no more cologne besides that. I don't know. Never heard of it. Might be because it's a made-up brand. All right, what are these things? Looks like some kind of little... I don't know what this is. They've been chewed on, though. Jetson. Almost looks like there's supposed to be wheels on the bottom, and there's not. Oh, I just touched something nasty. Oh, gross. All right, like that. There's a wheel in the front, but there's no wheel in the back. So I'm not really sure what this does or how it works. All right, moving up here. Looks like more books of some sort. It's like a, some kind of artist kit, but what kind of books are these? Um, okay, some kind of actual school books, it looks like. All right, here, this looks like a lot of camping stuff. This is tabletop stove. Okay, the case that it goes in has been cracked, but then... The actual stove there looks brand new. We got some sleeping bags. Um, that's a tent, five person tent. What is this? It's like a stuffed animal. It looks like maybe a stuffed animal snake maybe wrapped up in there. But yeah, sleeping bags. That's all what's in there, just sleeping bags. And then the tent. All right, here's the fun part. All these loose clothes, I'm taking the stuff that's kind of on the top that I see stains and nasty stuff on, putting in one bag, be trash, and then once I kind of get down and see stuff that's not bad, then we'll start bagging it up into other bags, stuff that we can sell. But loose clothes is always kind of a pain, and especially in this case where it's got mouse droppings on the stuff on the top, it's kind of nasty. All right, trying to clean up this corner here got a lot of clothes off at the top of some stuff we got a grave digger here lots of cords and so maybe the maybe a charger for the um hoverboards potentially in here what is that for that looks like it's to the um nintendo switch right there there's a little treasure chest and it's got some weight to it push that in I guess let's see that opens what in the world <laughs> there we go oh it's a little treasure it's got sand in there and little pirate stuff that's kind of cool kind of cool there all right that goes to a um, switch it's little end pieces that go on the controllers up oh, here we go you can see these right in front of me oh I hope these are in here switch games some of these can be really expensive. We got four cases. Are they going to be in here? No. 
no, no, I go on it, and no. All right, still holding out hope though. A lot of times you'll have a little bitty case but you'll stick those in. Here's a um, sound reactive LED strip. And then Google Chromecast. All right, what else is over here? There's part of a switch. This is part of a switch. Now have to definitely look really close. Oh, we got the Superman slot bracelet. Hold on. It needs to go right here, but my watch is there. Let me... There we go. Superman slot bracelet. I remember when these things came out when I was in elementary school. Well, they became popular. I don't know if that's when they first came out or not. So lots of cords, different stuff in there. Unfortunately, the, the games are not in there for the Switch. And then we got the duck glasses here. So we're still looking for the Switch and the Switch games. All right, we got the Thanos hand. And look, he's got all the Infinity Stones. Makes a little bit of noise there. But that's pretty cool. I guess that's... The only one that makes noise is the middle one there. So, more toys. Oh, what's down underneath here? Let's see. Oh, there's a whole bunch of Hot Wheels and stuff down in the bottom. There's like a, an organizer down there and see all that? It's full of the cars. Goon Squad, there's a Space Jam toy. It looks like we got a Buzz Lightyear hand too. Yep, you put that on and then, let's see. Probably need some some fresh batteries, but we got the Buzz Lightyear hand, we got the Thanos hand, an iron, some Hot Wheel stuff up. We got Spider Man. I think this is Thor here. We've got Thor up. Oh, Captain America. Some swords, more Hot Wheel stuff. Medieval time swords. No batteries on those. We do have a. Like a little, probably a toy chest right there. All right, the secret trunk here. Probably more toys based off of everything else. Man. Maybe a um, family of rats living in here. Oh, sorry, mice. Anne doesn't want to say rats. They're mice. Oh, my, Anne. More Nerf guns. They have a lot of Nerf. This is like my son when he was a kid. That's all he wanted was Nerf guns. From the time he was like six or seven to about... 11 or 12, I mean, just Nerf guns, Nerf guns, Nerf guns. They got plenty of them. And a weird Etch-a-Sketch, not a normal one, but... All right, Nerf guns. Nerf guns are expensive, though. All right, we've moved all the mattresses out that were right in this area. Got up most of the little stuff up there. We still got that, but now we're to a new batch of boxes. There's a lot of pictures right here. And more of the same toys. There was some stuffed animal there here I just took out because they were just kind of, every time I touched it, they were spilling out and most of those were kind of dirty. But more um, more Nerf guns. We got a Braves number one finger there. Let's see what else we got. More, more Nerf guns. Lots of Nerf guns. Minions. Let's see, what is this? Cowboy Air Mega, probably an air purifier. Yeah, I think that's what that is. Air purifier. Got a little plain styrofoam, but it's a little bit bent up, so I don't think it's gonna fly too well. We got a Husky little organizer with some hardware in it. Those always do well. We got one 30 pound, um, dumbbell there if we keep going back we got bikes a minion some homemade art let's see if we can check some of these other containers here looks like more toys this is the big boy up oh, yeah my son he had this nerf gun and these things are not cheap these big nerf guns like this i don't know what that is some kind of toy 
So we got um, Paw Patrol. Needs a little wipe off, but Paw Patrol. I think there's a new movie coming out, so maybe get some bids on some Paw Patrol stuff, if that's where we put it. Little state puzzle there. Giant floor puzzle. We got more Paw Patrol. See some other Paw Patrol, other toys down in there. A little toy guitar. First act. Those always sell. The guitars always sell, even the toy ones there. Always do all right. Looks like sheets. Let's keep moving down this way. Here's a dirty, a dirty little pillow. We get down here. Put, what do you know? More toys. Do we have Legos in here. Big Lego container. Let's see. Oh, we got a little a few Legos. That's another good seller. I said toys can be good. As long as it's not those just big bands of mixed up pieces, even sometimes that can turn out good, but you know what I'm saying. Stomp Rocket, here's a Pokemon, not a Lego, but a um, Mega Block figure there. See in there? Um, I think this is, yep, Beyblades Arena. Looks like some Beyblade stuff down in there. Looks like little toys, they kind of spin around and you have little fights with them. Lots of containers with no lids. A couple lids, but mostly no lids. A little smashed up lamp. Whoa. Coat rack can hang on the wall. A few decorative pieces here. Let's Oh, okay. Uh, PS, it was right here. I didn't even notice until just now. PS5 box. But I think it's empty, just like the Switch box. Yep, it's empty. That stinks. Just finding either one of those in there would have been huge. Either the Switch or the PS5. But as of yet, I haven't found any of that. More toys. Just lots of loose toys. Here's a Batmobile. So we got a Batmobile. Get down in here. Oh, another one of these guys. <laughs> got some shorts I got. Hold on, I think we got Woody and Buzz down here. Oh, we got the Incredible Hulk mask. Pirate mask. Black Panther mask. And these are the ones that have a little button you push in it. Um, if they work, then it will... Gonna make a noise. I think that's the button there, right there. So it probably needs batteries. Yeah, here we go. We got Buzz, Buzz Lightyear. We got Woody. I wonder if it's hats down in there or not. This isn't the really good one. Doesn't actually have the pull string like the nice ones have. And then down in here we got we got Yoshi and Mario on the four wheelers. I think these are probably like RC. No, that's Monster Jam. That's probably to that Grave Digger. So I don't know if the, the Mario and Yoshi controllers are not in here at least. All right, some bags here. We get, looks like a pretty nice cuisine art waffle maker. You know, one of those that flip around, stainless steel. Looks pretty good. Let's flip this around. There are a couple containers back here with lids. Just a few. We got art supplies and crayons and markers, all that kind of stuff. Um, more art supplies, pipe cleaner. There's a lot of paint down in there, popsicle stick kind of thing. Chalk, Play-Doh. The top of that thing is nasty, but let's see. Oh lord, that's not a good box. This is all like kids schoolwork. That's gonna be heavy. Um, this looks like some Christmas right here. Some kind of blow up down in there. 2018 Mickey and Minnie snow globe. Let's check.
check this one here. I hope it's not more schoolwork. Okay, no, but it's more, <laughs> more toys. Giant sunglass for Nerf guns. I'm just hoping to find that one with the gaming stuff in it, maybe. After we found those, the empty boxes and the empty, um, the empty cases for the Switch games. All right, if you want to see the number one selling set of end tables out there, if you buy storage units, you know these little IKEA end tables with the screw on legs. I don't know how many of these I've gotten over the years. There's a set right there. At least a hundred of these things, at least. But you see all those bags, ain't it? Those little white kitchen bags back there? That's what all the kitchen stuff was thrown in those white garbage bags dishes and all that stuff all right christmas stuff we got the little short nutcracker we got the snowman nutcracker and it's an advent calendar we got a camo santa hat and down under there there's all kinds of christmas it looks like christmas ornaments oh, no ornament there i thought there was gonna be a cool ornament There's a Hawaii ornament. Santa. Santa's climbing the, the palm tree to get a coconut, I guess. Twenty twenty is the date on that one. Wonder shop at Target. There's a little Target nutcracker. What else we got? Oh, those are actually Toy Story stockings, I think. Let's look down further. We got some homemade. We get the homemade Christmas ornaments. Look at that one. It's a big mess. It's just kind of all thrown in there. There's another little homemade, but just kind of a tangled up mess. But, ugh. And I keep finding weird stuff to touch every now and then. Oh, and over here in all these pictures and everything, Ann just found this. This is actually pretty cool. It's a Tony Gonzalez autograph. Tony Gonzalez tied in, put, ended up. He played for the Falcons in, but he played for Kansas City for years. Hall of Fame tight end. We got the autograph. We got the picture. So that's pretty cool right there. Good little find. All right, we're down to mainly just this corner right here that we haven't looked at. Oh, there's a case over here. Hold on. Down here on the ground. There's a sound bar laying right there. But let's look and see what's in this case underneath there there's a heater here's a sonic lunch box nothing in it well oh there's an old lunch in there they literally it's like the trash from some kid's lunch and it's just been in there forever there's a, a smashed yoohoo thing and it looks like there's yoohoo and other stuff oh it stinks now over here then i opened that i think been sealed up for who knows how long with old lunch in it all right, here's a vaults case. Let's see. It's heavy. There's something in it. Oh, it's a CD. Or they got, look, bootleg, Halloween, Ocean's 12. Mostly bootleg. There's a couple real ones. Final Destination 3, but that's the DVD case right there. This looks like a bunch of notebooks and stuff because it's clear and you can see on the side. Let's check and see. We got certificates. Looks like notebooks and stuff from school. Picture, uh, photo album. Yep, yeah, there is. That's a cool little rock, and it's got like a little cover, like a little bold out area there. You can put something in. Some kind of rock there. And just more books and notebooks. Parenting. I don't want to show that. Okay. All right, moving along here. One last corner. There's some nasty looking stuff. Kind of on the top there. Another lunch box. Is it? Does it have an old lunch in it? Nope, it's empty. It's just dirty on the outside. And that one feels empty too. They're both just a little dingy dirty on the outside. Look. 
It's a pile of crap with horns on it. I don't yeah, know. Yeah, I've never seen one. I, don't I guess that's bull crap. Oh, that's bull crap. That's what we say, bull. Here's some bull crap. <laughs> a Batman bucket. That's kind of cool there. Spider-Man bucket. And let's see anything under there. Not really a pair of binoculars. An old Tasco binoculars. So, not much else going on. Here's some Crunchberry, Captain Crunch. Crunchberry is, you know, one of the things drawing in. The mice in here and stuff like this. But, for the most part, that is it. Unless there's just something that we have missed, but I don't think we're going to find the gaming systems. Could find the games, you never know. Could find something. I don't know, what, what is that? Oh, it's a lion. Okay, I see it now. A lion, that looks like another lion picture of some sort. I don't know. Let me look at this right here. This is like a shadow box, I think. What's in it? Mm -hmm. See how it's hinged on that side? Yeah. Oh. Ooh. Oh wow, look at this. Last minute find here. We got the certificate of authenticity. This is a Jerry Rice autographed jersey. PSA certified there. You never know what you're gonna find. You gotta look at it, look at everything. I mean it, just never know. I mean it was over here mostly oh it's better quit showing that mostly kind of family pictures, cheap little canvas pictures. So we got the Tony Gonzalez autograph, but this is even better. This is really nice. And certified Jerry Rice autograph jersey. That's awesome, actually, right there. I'll take one last look around here. This last thing that's facing the other way, because you never know. Nope, just a some standard art. And the good thing is, is that's in good shape. Nothing you got in there to mess with it. But we gotta finish cleaning up all of this crap. There's also Wash machine. I already pointed that from the very beginning, but pretty decent looking wash machine. Obviously needs a little cleanup on the top like they all do. But that'll be a chunk there, probably $150 or more on that. So the unit, it'll make some money. That right there is gonna be worth a little chunk right there. Unfortunately, found the boxes for the gaming systems and that they weren't in there. Found a box for a handgun, it wasn't in there. Um, rats, mice, you know, all that kind of stuff was in here. Not to mention there were a few things that will had dog hair and it smelled like a dog. But Nerf guns. Overall, it's, not, it's an all right unit. Not a good or great unit. Not a bad unit. It's kind of all right. It'll make some money. Could have been way better if the rats wouldn't have gotten here and messed some of the stuff up. It would have been better. And then obviously we would have found some of the stuff that the boxes were. But that's how it goes. But overall, it's going to make money. Just, you know, like I always say, there's so much volume in here. So much stuff. When it comes to all the toys and books and clothes when all that stuff adds up definitely make some money but that's it for this one if you like this video give us a thumbs up leave a comment if you haven't already if you want to see us buy more units like this one some that would be even worse than this one nastier than this one and then some that are way way better when we find literal treasure cash money gold coins who knows subscribe to the channel y'all have a good one Alright, we got this unit back now. We're unloading it and we figured out that this was actually a single dad's unit. There were a few men's clothing items and then we found some pictures of a dad and three boys. It was all boy stuff. No girl stuff, no little girl stuff. There was no woman stuff, but it makes perfect sense because it looked like most all they had was um, toys. Like the dad was just buying toys, you know, to play with his sons with. Nerf guns, perfect toy for dad and sons to play with video games and books legos stuff like that and then you know as far as decor there was very very little decor and then the kitchen stuff kind of looked like an afterthought a couple of nice kitchen items like the waffle maker but most of it was just thrown into garbage bags so and then just a couple pieces of furniture but yeah no women's clothing no jewelry very little decor couple of the decor pieces were like an autographed jersey and another autographed piece so definitely looks like a single dad unit and that's what it was based off of everything that we saw but um don't get very many single dad units we do have gotten a few you get some man units but they normally don't have you know a whole lot of kids stuff maybe a few things because you know i guess typically single dad doesn't take the kids the majority of the time but this looked like the dad probably was the main one with these kids here anyways 
what happened not sure hopefully they moved on to bigger and better things from this unit you know we have no idea but that's what it is single dad unit